Dogs fill our lives with joy. They leave us often all too soon. But could an old drug find a new purpose and extend the years of your furry loved one? Dogs' lives are six to 12 times shorter than humans. But a new study called the Dog Aging Project aims to change all of that. 500 middle-aged dogs will be included in a double-blind placebo-controlled trial of rapamycin. The medication is currently FDA approved to prevent organ transplant rejection in people, but research shows it can extend the lifespan of mice. In fact, older mice on rapamycin are more metabolically active, have improved cardiac function and cognitive ability. So could this be the magic bullet to keep our furry friends around longer? Researcher and biologist Matt Caberlin joins us now via Skype with more on his study to extend the lives of dogs. So Matt, I have to ask you first and foremost, how did you even come up with this idea of the Dog Aging Project? I've been interested in studying the biology of aging for about 20 years now. Um, and dogs, I'm a dog person, I have three dogs, I love my dogs, I would really like my dogs to age more slowly and live longer. Um, and so, so as we all recognize, dogs age much more rapidly than people do. So this is a real opportunity to start to, to try to understand the biological aging process in the real world. So how did you come about using rapamycin in this study? Several labs, including mine, uh, in the mid-2000s became very interested in rapamycin because sort of independently, we all observed that um, either treating animals with rapamycin or genetically targeting the pathway that, that rapamycin inhibits led to increased lifespan and delayed onset and progression of age-related functional decline. In mice, for example, in the laboratory, if you give them rapamycin, they'll live anywhere from 15 to 25 percent longer. Um, but not only do they live longer, but, but sort of all of the functional declines that, that we see in laboratory mice, the declines in heart function, immune function, cognitive decline, all of those also appear to be either delayed or actually in some cases reversed. So what do you think your study on the dogs will show? Our prediction is that rapamycin will slow the aging process in dogs, um, increase lifespan, and delay the onset and progression of multiple age-related diseases. Um, specifically, what we've been focused on so far is heart function. Um, that's based in part on observations that if you give an old mouse rapamycin, within about 10 weeks, you can see a restoration of, of heart function uh, back to something that looks more like the heart of a young mouse. The doctors. 12 years in! The prognosis you prayed for. For the first time in public, I want to see if she can take a few steps. This is so scary. The treatment you needed. You look fabulous. It's the daytime talk show that's been your cure for over a decade. That is literally taking the lives from their community. I can't believe that this is happening. With the issues affecting your health right now. It is not housing, it is not economic inequality, it is a health crisis. I lied to you, and I lied to you. I have a truth that I'm going to reveal. The Doctors, on call for season 12.